a city manager's report. Thank you, Mayor and Council Nina Vetter, city manager. I'll keep it brief because it's getting late. Uh, so, um, I wanted to do a reminder of the recent um, direction that Multnomah County has given regarding the Vance property. I know we sent the link and information to Council, um, but I also want to make sure our community is aware of the progress as well um, and that they can find more information about it online. But the county, I believe it was in the last few weeks, released a master plan that's called the Vance Vision, which is a high-level master plan for development of the 90-acre site. Um, they anticipate through the master plan to have a combination of functions. It includes affordable housing, an employment center, a recreation center, as well as a regional park. So if you're interested in learning more, you can find out uh, more online uh, with Multnomah County. Also, council recently received um, an update on the My Gresham app. Uh, it was a report on the data from that. Um, and My Gresham, if... Um, anyone in the community is not familiar with it, is a way to report any incidents um, or requests um, that are streamlined. I think it's important to recognize the sheer volume of work that's coming through that to our staff. Um, the volume does vary by month, but at some points you see over 800 requests coming into our staff in one month. Uh, our most requested area is um, dismantled junk or cars. Um, so most of it's code enforcement. So a big shout out to our code enforcement team who is handling a lot of requests on a monthly basis um, through my Gresham. Um, so there's, we did send a, I think it was in a council update email. Um, there was some information about my Gresham, but it is interesting to see um, what we're getting through that. And again, really shout out to our code enforcement team. They do a lot of work with their limited staff. Coming soon is Arbor Day tree planting. On April 16th, a great opportunity to get outside from 9 a.m. to 12 at Columbia View Park. You can find out more on our website if you'd like to join. Um, it is in celebration of Arbor Day. You can make a lasting contribution to the health of our community by planting a tree. Uh, so please check out our website for more information if you want to participate in that great event. And last but not least tonight, our Gresham great woo, uh, <laughs> goes to um, our DES team. Uh, so there is a civil engineering cooperative program that's an internship, but it's not like the typical internship programs um, that we see at the city. It's a six month paid internship. Um, and it is for civil engineering, GIS, survey, and architectural engineering students to actually apply their skills and get experience in the prospective field. So it was a real great opportunity for us to show them how they could take their skills and translate that into public service. But it's a lot of work on our staff um, to have an intern uh, for six months, and they're really digging into some deep work. So thank you to Jeff and Wendy for mentoring and training our interns. Um, we appreciate the support of this important program um, to hopefully get more people interested um, in those fields in public service. So that is my report for tonight.